and welcome. Are you happy with your life? Do you live your dreams? Have you achieved every goal that you want in your life? Have you? I've seen my grandma. Let me take you to show you my grandma's life. My grandma was working really hard all her life. All I remember is her working, working, working. I've never seen her sleeping. I've never seen her resting. She was just going from working in the garden to working in the kitchen, from working in the kitchen to making the fire, from making the fire to, fe to feeding the children and grandchildren. She was always working. Never, never I've seen my grandma sleeping. Let me take you to my grandma in town. My grandma in town was the best wife you could possibly imagine. She was always cooking, she was always gardening, she was always busy. Again, I've never seen my grandma sitting down. And the only time she would sit down, she would sit down to read the book to us, or she would sit down to talk to us. She was a wonderful, wonderful lady. This is my mom. She was working really hard all her life. She was doing the business, she was doing the kitchen, she was tending to the children. I always remember my mom working, working, working. Always busy, always running about. It was very hard. She could never let herself rest. Never. She was always busy working. In order for her to sustain her energy, Let me see this. I got the cigarette. In order to, to sustain her energy, she was always, always drinking coffee. Coffee, coffee, coffee. Lots of coffee, gallons of coffee. Really strong, thick coffee. To give her energy. But to give her relaxation and rest, she would smoke. She smoked a lot. She smoked and smoked and smoked and smoked to relax. There was no other way in her mind to relax. She has not achieved her goals. She has not lived her dreams. And she was really ill when she finally passed away. She had diabetes. She was really ill when she passed away. And this is me. I've done the babies. I've done the cooking. I've done the PTAs. I've done the DIY. I've done more cooking. I've done feeding the babies, I've done nappies, I've done all the washing, I've done everything. And I still am. I'm still doing everything around the family. I'm doing the washing, the cooking, the cleaning, everything that I'm required. I'm also helping at school. But I also realize that for me, it's not enough. And I had to overcome many, many things. I had to overcome poor body image, I had to overcome poor self-esteem, I had to overcome not being able to work for so many years, and I have overcame. Two years in study, two years in learning, oh, that's the city. I have overcame me being just mom and housewife. I have turned myself into a glamorous woman. My life belongs to me. I read the books. The food that heals. I use my mobile phone to work. I earn my own money. I have become everything what my mom and my grandma could not ever become. And what, who do you want to become? What are your dreams? What are your ultimate dreams? What are your ultimate goals in life? And who and what you would like to become? Who would you like to be in your life? Is it five minutes? Not yet. No, you've got. 15 more, no, 20, 30 more seconds okay. to be so, safe and finish a few seconds early. Okay, so how did I achieve that? I had to learn how to meditate. I had to learn how to read the right books. I had to learn how to converse with the right people. I had to uh, acquire mentors. I have, I have a people who believe in me. I went out and I searched and I searched and I searched what my dreams are. And I think I found my dreams. So now I'd like to ask you in this few seconds that I have left, what do you want to do in your life? What is there that's something amazing in you that you haven't unleashed yet? What gift, what talents, what, um, what dreams do you have? And are you about to bring them to life? And in order to bring those dreams to life, you have to have good health, you have to have the right attitude to life, and you have to have the right tools. Five minutes.